and welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to be filming a Lush haul. I haven't been to Lush in ages and I thought I would go and pick a few things up. I have a bath in my new house that I've got that I'm renting and it means that I'm able to use bath bombs, bubble bars, anything like that. And usually I don't pick up a lot of things from Lush because I find them kind of expensive like for what they are like some bath bombs are like seven pounds and that's seven pounds gone in one bath like that is a lot of money to me but i saw quite a few things that were only like three pounds or two pound fifty you know some things were that i got like six pound fifty but they were like bubble bars which i just think are more value for money but yeah i've got a few things to show you so let's go so the first thing that i got is this sleepy bear now this was a decent price i'm not sure how much um this was exactly but i think it was only like three pound fifty um this is a bath bomb and i'm assuming that when you pop it in the bath it goes like a purpley color maybe because it's got the um kind of like purple like section on its back and I don't know, I thought he looked really cute and he probably will be quite a calming bath bomb. So maybe the kind of one to have at night. If I do any vlogs, by the way, in the future, I will show you me using these. Oh, I did also pick up another bath bomb that I used last night. I can't remember what it's called, but it's pink and it looks like a Christmas pudding. I will insert the footage of that now. I also got a bath bomb called the Snowman Finger Puppet. So, oh, I see. That's cute. I didn't even know that, that you could put it on your finger. But yeah, that's so cute. I swear this was £2.50. Like, this was one of the cheapest ones that they did. So if you're looking for some kind of like a stocking filler or just like something extra to buy somebody as part of their present, something like this would be quite cute, I think. And yeah, it's just a plain, simple bath bomb. I can't imagine that he will really change the colour of the bath that much. But if you want to know like what these bath bombs actually do and whether they um, change the colour of the bath or whatever, but then go on Lush's website because it will explain more about these. I just can't be bothered to do that. I then picked up this, which I think is maybe my favourite thing I got. This is Snow Dragon. So this here, I think was £3.50. And I thought this was amazing. It, I might be wrong with the price, by the way. It might be like £4.50. But I think this looks so nice. Um, and it smells really, really nice. I particularly love like the crystals on his back. When I was younger, I was really into crystals and anything to do with like rocks, but like really nice looking rocks and, you know, crystals and things like that. And yeah, this looks really cool to me. It smells so nice. It's got like a lemon sherbetty smell. I do think that some of Lush's products can smell a little bit iffy. Like the woman who worked in the shop asked me, oh, what do you think to this CBD bath bomb? And I smelt it and I was like, oh, well, I actually don't really like the smell. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, it was just awkward because it's like, I'm not gonna lie to her and say it smells amazing because it didn't. This one is called Gift Horse. And I think this was £4.50. And I'm assuming that this will make your bath go orange. Now, this reminded me of the donkey off of Shrek. I don't know why, because the one of Shrek isn't orange, but I just thought this looked really cute. And it's quite a decent sized bath bomb. And it's one of the cheaper ones that they did. And that's kind of the reason why I picked it up. I'm not usually a bath bomb person in terms of like, I don't normally go for bath bombs from Lush because I try and get, you know, what's, value for money and i usually go for bubble bars because i find them to be you know better value for money than a bath bomb but i don't know i was just liking the bath bombs this time but i do have a bubble bar here this one is the snow fairy bubble bar now i have had this many times and that's why i picked it up because i know that i like it i like the color that it makes my bath it's also nice and glittery so it's like a nice bath time experience and it also smells really nice i love the smell of this and it's kind of like a bubble gummy smell almost but yeah 
this is one I've had many times and I will continue to repurchase. All you do is you take a little bit off of this and you crumble it under running water and it just makes your bath really bubbly and also a nice colour and smell. Another bubble bar that I picked up, this one I haven't used before and this one was called... I'm not sure it's kind of rubbed off but I think it was the sleepy bubble bar um, and I think that's true because it's in the shape of a cloud. It's kind of like pastel -y colours and I just really like the look of this. I think this looks really great and yeah I can't wait to give this a go. The smell of this is quite nice as well. It's not as nice as the, ba um, the bubble bar that I've just shown you but yeah I do think this is nice so I'm going to give that a go and I will let you know what I think to it. And the final thing that I picked up from Lush is this. And this is called the Butter Bear. And I believe that this was £3.50. I swear they used to have a different Butter Bear and he was a lot smaller than this. And yeah, this is quite a decent size. And I think this is worth the money, to be honest with you, um, from Lush anyway. And smells oh my god i thought this was going to smell better than it did but it actually doesn't smell as nice as i thought but i can deal with it it's fine um, i'm assuming that it will make the bath like a little bit of a subtle purpley color but yeah that's quite cute that's everything that i got from lush i feel like i got a lot for me considering you know i don't really like to waste money on loads of stuff even though recently i've been spending you know more money than normal because after Christmas, I'm going to be saving for a house, so I'm kind of like treating myself now. They also gave me two free samples of fairy dust, which is just like a little sample pot of glittery dust. So I don't know what to do with that, I'm not going to lie to you, because I think you put it on your body, you don't put it in the bath. So I'm not sure when I'm going to actually use that, but there we go. So yeah, I know this was only a short video, but I just wanted to film it because, I don't know. I like Lush and I like watching people show what they bought from Lush. There was a few festive things in this video. But yeah, thanks for watching. Give the video a thumbs up if you liked it and please subscribe and I will see you in my next one. Goodbye.